Hi, my name is Daryl Ford, Chief Information Officer here at Roger Williams University. This is IT. I'm excited to share with you the latest technology happenings on campus over the past year. You'll learn about our recent Office 365 email migration, the new Providence campus technology, wireless upgrades impacting the campus community, and the new music technology classroom with Professor Elliot McKinley. I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the IT staff, Mercedes Matos and Ron Zito, both serving the Providence campus. Though Mercedes is new to our team, she's made a big impact on the campus community, coming in as runner-up in this year's Customer Service Award. Also, please join me in congratulating desktop services technician Jason Nataya as the Customer Service Award recipient. For the latest information on IT services and support, visit our new website at it.rwu.edu. Thanks, and enjoy the video. Hello. My name is Ryan Tebow, and I would like to take this opportunity to introduce you to our new email system, Office 365. This past summer, we completed our campus-wide migration, moving all of our mailboxes into the cloud. Office 365 email comes with an increase in storage. We have moved from an email quota of 500 megabytes to 50 gigabytes. If you haven't used it already, you should also check out the much easier to use web interface for email, calendar, and contacts. Office 365 is also much more than just an email system and will provide the university with more functionality than ever before. One terabyte of online storage using OneDrive is included and files can be accessed from anywhere. Users also have access to the suite of Office products to use online, including Word and Excel. If you still prefer to use Office applications from your computer, Office 365 allows users to install the full Office suite on up to five devices for free. Go to the IT website for more information about Office 365 and be sure to check out our info session recorded here on campus at the link below. Hi, my name is Tatiana Rigel and I'm an Information Technology Student Assistant at the Media Tech Desk. Here at Information Technology, we take pride in constantly improving our network to bring you the best experience possible. Based on student feedback, we added outdoor wireless to areas around the quad, Global Heritage Hall, athletic fields, and all on-campus residence halls. Also, in the coming weeks, the connections to the Bay Point Inn and Conference Center, as well as Almeda Apartments, will be upgraded to improve your internet experience. To continue to improve, we need to hear from you. Should you have any concerns, please contact the IT Help Desk at 254-6363, and we'll do our best to provide the customer service you deserve. Hi, I'm Mercedes Matos and I'm a Technology Support Specialist with the IT Department. The move to the new Providence campus last summer allowed IT to expand its technology services to continuing studies, the School of Law, and other programs that are in the One Empire building. We now offer fast internet, loaner equipment, and technology-rich classrooms, including three rooms with built-in distance education equipment. We also opened an IT office at the Providence campus with me, providing your general technology support during the day. We also have Ron Zito providing classroom and event support assistance in the afternoons and evenings. To get assistance or learn more about what we have to offer, stop by room 210 at One Empire or contact Media Tech by phone or email. My name is Dr. Elliot Miles McKinley. I am Assistant Professor of Composition, Music Theory, and Music Technology at Roger Williams University. Uh, I had a a position at Indiana University East and had developed a lab similar to this one but not nearly as as nice. Uh, so I knew more or less what needed to happen in terms of the computers, the software, the hardware, what I envisioned in terms of what would be uh, interesting for the students and also of long-term value. Now, the technology in the space uh, uh, consists of 12 uh, Macintosh uh, student workstations. Uh, the workstations contain a variety of software. All of the software is more or less designed for editing, um, music production, and mostly music creation. Uh, we also have a main workstation that has the same software and a few other packages as well, some larger soft, uh, sound libraries, uh, Logic Pro, and some video editing stuff. It's made the curriculum possible. If we didn't have the lab, we wouldn't be teaching, there would be no track in technology. Mm -hmm. 